beautiful day today. Uh, we are going down to the boathouse and we're going to walk along the water. Exploring the manly area. Is that right? Yep. Correct. It's not that we don't know what's here though. Just enjoying it. Yeah. That's the plan. We just got another incredible spot. We have good luck here. Yeah. It's just local luck, you know? Local luck. You can see the way things are and how it drives me mad. How about you I got a chai and it's really well made. I got home from placement at 3 and I've been editing my vlog and I haven't done any exercise today and I don't feel like it but I probably should do something but yeah I'm just chilling on the couch dinner yum 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 off to life group this is the comfy fit I've got my sweater trackies clogs and this shirt i got it from the todd's new house they found it when they were moving in and i was like i don't have it looks cute so that's what i'm wearing it's washed obviously but yeah i'm keen for a fun night got my dessert in hand ready to go from Pokemon at like four o'clock. I haven't set foot on a treadmill in over a week and I don't know, I'm not beating myself up over it because I've been busy. The last two nights though, I've just purposely decided not to do it. Um, but I'm starting Pilates this Saturday, so I'm excited for that. And tomorrow I'll get back onto the treadmill. Um, I'm not exercising because I'm like, I've got to, you know, whatever or whatever. But I do like how it makes me feel. So I'll get back onto it tomorrow. But um, tomorrow is my last day of placement ever. Um, I've done four years as a radiography student. And tomorrow is my last unpaid day in a hospital ever. And I am very excited about that. But also... Like, I don't think it's quite hit me that I'm literally less than six weeks away from finishing uni forever. That's kind of crazy. Um, but in radiography, and I don't know if it's other health courses or whatever, but on your last day of placement, you bring a little gift for the place that you've been, which is normally food. So tonight after dinner, I'm going to go get food for tomorrow. And it's also a tradition that the radiography place sends you home early, like halfway through the day, which some places don't do it, but all the places that I've been to pretty much do. But I've washed my hair, cleaned my room a bit, and I'm finally opening a package for Maurizia. Where's my dress on that? I got a, like three pack of socks. I got a... I should just show you. Hang on. I think I'm a professional unboxer now from unpacking at the Tods. Or maybe not. Ooh. Ooh, this is cute. Huh.
Polina cut the, an apple in these little chips. It's so yum. I'm going to do this more. Mm -mm. Okay. I got a pair of socks. I mean, three pairs of socks. But they're just like crew socks that are plain. Should be cute. We'll see. I got another pair of sweat shorts but they're high-waisted because I've been wearing mine so often that I was like, I could definitely do with another pair. So this, and then also, I mean, this is the, what I'm most excited about. A, like a bodysuit. I'm gonna try it on ASAP. Um, okay, but this. This is literally the comfiest thing I've ever worn. It's like buttery soft. I ordered a size small and there's like this thing that you can type in on the website. Like it has like your height, your weight, and then it tells you like people around your, I don't know, body type ordered this size. Um, and most people my size ordered an extra small, but this part of my body and my shoulders are quite broad. And I didn't want to order an extra small cause I knew it was going to like chop me off at the armpits. So I sized up and went a small. And it fits perfect. Um, I tried on the sweatshorts and it's sad. I ordered the wrong one. Real sad. Um, I'll show the difference. So I these are my OG ones that I ordered like a few months ago. And I wanted to order another pair that was just like a bit high, more high-waisted. But I ended up ordering these instead. And they're just wrong. They're the wrong fit. Hang on. Just ignore how ridiculous this looks. But this is their like boyfriend fit. And so it's like looser. And then let me show you the other one. So those ones that I just had on were a size small. And I wanted to order an extra small because those are a bit big. And I thought like, oh, I'll order an extra small instead. So I got an extra small in the non-oversized. So I ordered a small size and it's small. It still fits me, but it's not a cute look. <laughs> look at this, looks crazy. It, they're okay, but they're not cute. <laughs> and I can't really return them, so I think I'm just going to sell them on Depop. Rest in peace. These are the socks, they're perfect length. Very happy with the socks, so win and a win, but a fail on the pants. Today's my last day and I'll be going home early. Um, so I'm starting at nine o'clock instead, which is delicious. Like I've been awake for an hour and I still have like another 20 minutes before I have to get up. That's pretty nice. Um, but I woke up remembering the feeling that I had on the first day of every placement that I've ever had and realizing that all of that comes to an end today and that I'm so proud of myself for finishing four years of being a student on placement like I still have assessment and I still have exams 
but placement is over and I'm so proud of myself. I think I've done something stupid like 56 weeks of placement, which is crazy. Hate to say it, but placement is a scam. Placement is an absolute scam. But yeah, I also woke up thinking, I stained my uh, white sweater last night with my bubble tea. And I also woke up thinking, I hope that uh, nappy Sam worked. So I'm gonna check on that too. But yeah, those are the two feelings that I had waking up. I'm back from placement. They let us go at 11. MVPs, thank you very much. But I got home and walked on the tread. I'm gonna have a shower now. And then this afternoon I'm hanging out with Justin. He wants to go to um, some op shops and look for film cameras, which we'll see if we have any luck. I was gonna do a voiceover for this part of the video, but I couldn't talk over this audio because I just find it so funny. <laughs> Oh, no way. No way. It's the camcorders. Very cool. But it's going to be hard if there's no charger. Yeah. Check the other bits in the bag. Maybe that's a charger. <laughs> Are you going to put this audio in there or what? <laughs> so it uses the dog. That's awesome. It's matcha from the shops, and we're gonna see if it's good. It's never too late to change. I find it hard to believe things are just better this way. Though we may not quite agree, it's never too late to change. Okay, this might be disgusting. Yeah. It's good. Maple syrup part, not so That's good. why I said like maple syrup has too much of a strong flavor. The maple syrup is gross. Okay, right. I think it needs to be a bit colder. Not bad, pretty yeah. good. Pretty good. Justin's new, new camcorder, but he doesn't know if it works because he doesn't have a charger. Shut up. Up, up, and he and he cleaned gunk out of it. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of gunk. This is the comfy fit for family dinner. Uh, long sleeve stripy shirt, sweat shorts, clogs and socks, random baggy. And I'm gonna bring my new balances for the walk if we end up going. But it's kind of rainy, so honestly doubt it. Doubt it. I was gonna leave for Jackson's, but he actually won't be home for another like 30 minutes. So I'm gonna leave in 10 and then it should time out well. So I'm just gonna sit in my car until then. But we're doing like a potluck family dinner style thing. Everyone's bringing something. I'm bringing a macaroni and cheese dish that like you put in the oven. Lachlan's bringing like Thai. So I think it's going to be like the most random dinner. Maybe I'll get a tummy ache. But I think it will be fun. It's our first family dinner in their new house. So it should be good. Tomorrow night, uh, me, Jackson, Lachlan and Lily are going to Happy Boy for dinner. Because Lachlan and Jackson helped a friend move and he gave them Happy Boy vouchers. So we're going to use them. It's like a little celebration for finishing placement which will be really fun and then maybe on saturday i'm definitely going to pilates at 9 15 and then jackson and i might go to the beach and then i think we were talking about going to like a soak session with lachlan and lily um so that might happen so yeah it should be a fun um next few days. sometimes you're physically So 
through my desk the like top shelves of my cupboard my bathroom like sink under the sink and the drawers and this is what I have so far and I still have to go through my clothes and then vacuum and clean my room but I'm stopping for lunch <laughs> Tom Tom. Happy boy. Happy girl. And happy girl. <laughs> um, my happy pony, people. My ponytail. Bubble. Do you like it? Yeah, I do actually. this morning i'm kind of nervous for it i don't know how it will go but i'm sure it will be fine <laughs> seven till three today and it was really fun it was easy chill i'm just chilling on the couch now i should have a shower and then we're going to church this afternoon <laughs> Is uh, not good right now, so I'm blasting my face with aircon. 